taken up by Sean Quinlan to try and mount a challenge. Rambo Tree Tennessee uh, of uh, Bluefin, who's now within a length and still trying to close down towards the final flight. Race on here. Rambo T to the near side. Bluefin, the far side has got no run. They're running out. Oh, they both crashed out at the final flight of hurdles both crashing out and that leaves it's Maisie to come down to jump the final flight it's Maisie at it now staggers over it but got away by 15 to 20 in second place is Bilbo River he's coming down to the flight now but it's Maisie left in the clear after the drama at the last flight of hurdles it's Maisie will come clear to win by the best part of 25 lengths it's Maisie's gone on to score for Sue Smith and Ross Chapman Bilbo River will finish in second carnage at the final flight And that is an understatement, carnage at the final flight. Both jockeys are up OK, the horses are OK. Fergus Gregory and Sean Quinlan leaving. It's Maisie to come home in splendid isolation. I don't think Ross Chapman is going to ride a, a more fortuitous winner this season. You can see the jockeys there. The replay will be interesting. It seemed to me as if, Blue, uh, as if Rambo T was just hanging to the right as we look it, out, out to the left. The other one was trying to get in. There wasn't much room there uh, while Rambo T was hanging out to the left Sean Quinlan on blue fin was trying to get in with in the right side of the wing and there was um, an almighty collision and we say it over and over again the plastic the plastic rails have been there for a long time but thank goodness they are because that could have been really really nasty and in the end it's Maisie who only had one run over hurdles I think it'll go down as a lucky win because she was well beaten. She had some good bumper form. But um, obviously the stewards will be having a look at that and having a look at the replays, see if anyone was to blame. But uh, I'm sure you'll be looking at the uh, head on, Sean. But we've had, we had a biblical storm. We had thunder and lightning. We've had hail. And now we've had one of the most dramatic finishes that um, have been seen at Sedgefield in recent years. And there have been a few dramas here.